and to everyone in the 7th Congressional District that change isn't waiting any longer. We have arrived, change is coming, and the future belongs to all of us. We begin tonight with a change that couldn't wait. Last night, the result was early and decisive. A stunning Democratic primary upset for Ayanna Presley over Boston's congressman for the past 20 years, Mike Capuano. The city councilor from Dorchester captured almost 60% of the vote following recent upset victories over mainstream Democrats in New York City and Florida. For the families and victims of senseless gun violence, change can't wait. For our brothers and sisters behind the wall, change can't wait. To our immigrants worried about the knock on the door, change can't wait. To women whose rights are perpetually under attack, change can't wait. To the residents of the 7th Congressional District, change can't wait. You, your families and friends, neighbors all, demanded, expected, and deserved more. You saw what I saw, that these times demanded more from our leaders and from our party. That these times demanded an approach to governing that was bold, uncompromising, and unafraid. That with our rights under assault, with our freedoms under siege, that it's not just good enough to see the Democrats back in power, but it matters who those Democrats are.